Uh, I, want, I want to go back a little bit. You said about the, um, you know, really, you know, leaning into your confidence, you know what I'm saying, with what you learned. Was it anything that, like, I guess, was it was it a point that happened when you was like, man, you know, I'm struggling with my confidence. It's, it's, it's not there. Like, was it was it something mm-hmm. that happened? Yeah, just certain things will happen, like, professionally and in my in my personal life where, you know, I would let opportunities to speak up pass me by. Mm. And then, in retrospect, it'd be like... You know, it's like you you working for a company, you working on a project, mm-hmm. and you know somebody has an idea, and the, your team is rolling with it, and in your mind you like this ain't gonna work, or no, nah, we should tweak this to mm-hmm. make it better, mm-hmm. and then you know, but you don't say it because you got low confidence, and then time goes by and it proves that what you was thinking was right. You Follow, know, following your instincts yeah, and your gut. and like, t- man, probably like five to ten things like that just happened. Mm. Again, both professionally and in my personal life where it's like, dang, I didn't speak up on this. But if I did, like, you know, it would have cha- it, it could have changed the world, and, at least in a micro. And you, be, and you be knowing in your heart. You be knowing the, the answer to what towards what. Yeah. Yeah. But you like, and that also ties back to that, like I said, just putting in my 10000 out, which is a good thing. But on the flip side... You know, it, it can be a bad thing if you if you think you in a a lower place than you really are. Yeah. So. Yeah. You know that 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 I think that that's um that that's valuable, man, because it's like 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 you said, man, it's one thing to be aware of you know something that you want to work on, which is like that's one of the most important pieces. Is like you know to be it's to be aware and know that it's you know it's something about you that you you know want to change, you know, something that you want to work mm-hmm. on. That's a huge step right there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But it's a either a step further to say, all right, I'm going to do something about it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to take the necessary action to follow up on. And it's hard, bro. Man, it's like, beyond hard. <laughs> when you figure out something about yourself, like, first, the conversation in itself ain't mm-hmm. easy. Like, mm-hmm. like, dang, bro, like, I got low self, I got low confidence. Like, yeah. what? Yeah. <laughs> and then, like, to, to actually start putting the work in, like, it ain't. It ain't easy. I Man, know. I heard um I was listening to an interview the other day, um, listening to um to Will Smith. He was on he was on a podcast. And he was like, uh <clears throat> he said, We've we've been uh we've kind of been like taught and educated that life is this supposed to be this romanticized and this like this competition and it's supposed to be like this like picture perfect sexy thing mm-hmm. when really life is really just school it's it's really just education you know what i'm saying we're supposed to learn as much as we can and not necessarily from a a tech standpoint from like you know from schooling and things like that not necessarily your um your sy- systemic way of learning but like just like you said about learning experiences you knew with internally you knew the answer to what was what but you also seen the opportunity pass, but then you knew like, damn, you know what? If I would have just did this, then it yeah. would have helped me. You learn you learn something and you was able to teach yourself something in that moment. And that's what life really is about. You For know what sure. I'm saying? But we have a hard time of like welcoming that aspect of, of life. You know what I'm saying? Because it For is sure. hard. Yeah, and you still gotta have fun with it. Like it, it's all trial and error. Like we had a, a T a year or two ago that was just like the game will test you. Mm-hmm. Like it's gonna test you. You just gotta you know, you got to want to live up to You got to want to win. Yeah. You got to still have that fun. Yeah. And, like, one thing my dad said when I was younger that stuck with me, again, just always listening, he probably don't even remember this, but he's just like, you just don't want to have no regrets. Like He like was telling that to you or he was just saying that in generally about life? He was telling that to me. Yeah. Yeah, like, you don't want to have no regrets. I'm probably, like, 12, 13 at the time. Like I said, he probably don't even remember telling me this, but it stuck. That's a real. That's a real thing. 